The next question, the member for Scarborough Gildwood. Thank you, Speaker. My question is to the Deputy Premier. With the variance of concerns ripping through Scarborough, Brampton, and the hottest of hotspots, we are not doing enough to protect our communities and to protect essential workplaces. And, uh, you know, the clinics in Scarborough are still closed, the hospital clinics. So you have promised a 50 per cent uh, increase to hotspots, and we are going to look for that. Workers at Fiat Chrysler Automotive reached out to me to ask what we are doing to protect people working in Ontario plants. When will they be prioritized? Many of these workers live in non-hotspot postal codes and therefore ineligible for a vaccine in their home community. But every day, they go to the hottest of hotspots. So my question sure. to the Deputy Premier is, when will these workers who work in the hottest hotspots, putting their lives and their families at risk, receive a vaccine? And to reply, Minister Clark. Thank you very much. Well, I can certainly agree with the uh, member opposite that there are many hot spots in Scarborough right now. I believe there are 15 postal codes that have been identified as having hot spots. Uh, they will be receiving presently. 25% of the vaccines from the top are going to the hot spots in Peel in Toronto, and we are. Uh, looking at 50% because we know that if we address the transmission in the hotspots, including in, in Peel, in Brampton, as well as in Scarborough, that will be for the benefit of everyone on Ontario because 80% of the transmission is happening in 20% of the locations. So we are prioritizing that. We know that we need to uh, deal with uh, getting more vaccines into those areas. And now with the increase in vaccines coming, uh, starting next week, we will be able to do that without in any way taking Response. away any vaccines that are going to any other place. So with those additional vaccines, we will be prioritizing those hotspots in Peel as well as in Scarborough and other parts of Toronto as well. Okay. Thank you. The time for question period this morning has expired.